Hey guys, welcome back to the Gamer Guide channel. Tonight is an exciting night as we had a big announcement from Allo Games. They announced their new game and they also showed the sneak peek of things upcoming in No Man's Sky. So we'll take a look at that first. As you see here, we have uh, some of the recap here of 2023. I changed the music in this clip. I wasn't sure if I was gonna get in trouble, copyright or whatever, since this comes from IGN. Brand new ship, it looks like. I'm very excited about that. And it uh, looks like we have an interior change and an exterior change on the space stations. That is super cool and uh, looking forward to that. They say 2024 could very well be before them. That right there was No Man's Sky, a game we announced 10 years ago with this guy right here, Sean Murray. Sean, uh, looks like the content keeps rolling in 2024. But what does the next decade look like for Hello Games? Well, to start with, uh, next year is going to be a really big year for No Man's Sky. Like you said, I've been working on it for 10 years yeah, now. That's a big announcement. And I still really love it, still really enjoy it. But what people don't know is that for the last five years, we've been working on something new. Oh, uh, another game. Yeah, something very different, something maybe more ambitious. More um, ambitious. Wow. You know, for... <laughs> Uh, Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, no Man's Sky is like the most ambitious game. Tell us a bit about it, Sean. Uh, well, for No Man's Sky, we generated a whole universe mm -hmm. of kind of sparse, alien-looking planets. And that wasn't easy, you know, it was hard, but there is something that's much harder that we wanted to do. Uh, for our new game, we wanted to create an Earth, um, you know, something as varied, a planet that is as varied as a universe, something bigger than Earth. Wow, bigger than Earth. Something with, you know, mountains, real mountains, not video game mountains, but mountains that are miles high, okay. taller than so Everest. A little more complexity, you I like it. Climb to the top of them and look out, you can see rivers and canyons and continents. You know, you can see oceans. So you is can, this like an open world planet kind of thing? Yeah, I mean, the first real open world. Right, something without boundaries. Uh, and we're gonna let everyone play in it together. Wow, it's, that's cool. You know, Massively a place where people can what if it's live out be their Elmo. sort of yeah. adventures together. Are we gonna have subscriptions? Well, we can't wait Hello to uh, take a look at it. it. Might be a company to actually. Do you have anything tonight or to future? <laughs> or? Yeah, yeah, so, so we have a trailer. Oh. Um, and, you know, it's quite a small team that's working on us. Yeah. There's about a dozen of us. We're actually, everyone's here. The, the, everyone from the team is here. Uh, we're s uh, we're very excited to share this. You and I've been talking about this one for years. Yeah, we're we're super nervous, you know, but uh, really excited. If you know, if people like it, this is a game I would like to still be updating ten years from now. All right, so Game Awards 2033. Game. <laughs> We'll be back, but no. Uh, let's take a look. This is such an incredible project, way, and I'm honored that we can show the it up. Should we, we do it, Sean? Yeah, let's check it. it out. Here we go. So you can go there right now and wishlist it. All right, here we go. Again, change the music on the trailer as they were using Alt J's "Hunger of the Pines," and I know that for sure is going to get flagged. But we got a fantasy realm. It looks like real similar graphics to No Man's Sky. Uh, not that that's bad at all. I like it. I like the art style. And cool swimming animations. Looks like we're going to have lots of different creature types on the planet. Lots of different bio types, too, on the planet. See a dragon? We got hang gliders. Looks like building in the background. I can see people bringing in different materials to build a settlement, so that will be neat. You know, this sort of reminds me a little bit of Pax Day as far as the scale and uh, the theme of it. So sort of a massively multiplayer with all your friends sort of situation. We got dragons you can ride. Very neat. So there's definitely going to be some flying transportation in the game, whether it be birds, hang gliders, dragons. Love the mountains. Looks like we got a beacon up here on the mountain. Pretty interesting. And then something floating over there on the top left of the screen. Not sure what that is, but that's pretty cool. And it looks like, man, that looks like a Corvax in the background. <laughs> Did you guys see that? It looks like a giant Corvax. All right, here we got some rabbit creatures and looks like maybe a, a orc sitting over on the left side. A lot of cool stuff you can do here with the flying dragons. That will be fun. And then here at the end, it looks like 
another almost atlas like thing we got all the red going on something's being formed and then we have this ball but yeah this is called uh, light no fire like I said you can get this right now on um, Steam if you go to Steam you'll see the game so I already put it on my list definitely going to give it a try. Remember, that anyway, that's the big news for tonight. An independent team. Absolutely incredible. I've been waiting for years to show that to you. And uh, again, created by the team at Hello Games. So uh, very, very exciting. And I'm excited to uh, see games like that that show kind of the next decade of where games are going to. Sounds like he's known about it for a little while. That's neat. Brand new game, Light No Fire. That should be really cool. I uh, liked a lot of the visuals I saw. Um, I don't want to get too overly hyped about it, but I'm definitely going to try it out when it comes out. And the new spaceship, um, I, saw, I guess you guys saw too, the new fighter in the space station looks really nice. New interiors, new exteriors. It should be something to look forward to. Even if we have to wait till 2024, that's cool. But um, yeah, big news tonight. Check it out, guys. Light No Fire. I'll see you guys next time here on the Gamer Guy channel. Bye-bye.